<laughs> okay then. We will turn to the Bard for inspiration. The Merchant of Venice, Act 2, Scene 7. The Prince of Morocco pulls a scroll from the eye of a skull and reads, All that glisters is not gold. Often have you heard that told. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress, I presume you're eager to get back to your story. But here's a thing. Everything may not be entirely as it seems. <sighs> Probably shouldn't have said that. Floating death trap. Sign up for a trip to Creep Town. Something about this place is making my hair stick up so far it's gonna jump out of my neck. Dickheads want with us. Ah, man. <laughs> Oh 
Watson, il y a une porte ici. OK. All of you. Into the room. place. Given our observations that this is some sort of ship and seems to be abandoned, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say it's some sort of abandoned ship. No shit, Sherlock. You gonna write a book about it? Give him a break, Fliss. He needs one. We can't just sit around. We need a plan. We're not exactly in the best position to be making any moves. The second they let their guard down, we gotta take advantage of it and get off the ship. Yeah, man. This whole rust bucket's one tetanus shot from the bottom of the ocean. We already tried to escape. Didn't exactly work out. We gotta get back to the boat and find Brad. They swiped our distributor cap. Gonna be difficult to get anywhere without it. So can't we just, like, hotwire or something? You cannot hotwire distributor cap, okay? These assholes knew exactly what they were doing. While those guys are out panning for Manchurian gold or whatever they think they're gonna find on this floating coffin, we gotta take advantage and look around for a way out of here. Fliss, I just wanted to say that, um, I might have gotten things kind of wrong back there. Uh, excuse me? I may have kind of prematurely come to the conclusion that maybe, you know, you're working some kind of side deal with these guys, or whatever. But I, I mean, obviously that's not true. They're being just as bad to you as they are to us, so, yeah. Allow me to translate. He's saying that he's sorry. Well, I... Hmm. Well, your apology is kinda accepted. Cool. Cool. What happened here? So, when we told you this would be a quick little adventure... Was there something in this small print? Should we expect an itemized bill for all these, uh, extras? Yeah. Kidnapping, 750 a head. Extra time, 350 an hour. Mm -hmm. Listening to your stupid bickering? I'll get back to you on that one. It's not charging us for the damage to your boat. <sighs> hey, look what I found over here. Get it open. Hey, come here. Maybe.
Maybe we can bend it open and get out of here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We don't know where a vent like this would go. I think we just gotta find out. You want me to just smash through this wall? No, I got this. Someone should create a distraction. This is gonna be loud. Yeah, okay. Conrad, you do it. I'm the reason she got snagged. No way. No heroics. We gotta get as far away from here as we can. Shit. You're right. Mystery of the smelly sock. of people on board. Hundreds. How could they all just vanish and leave all of their stuff behind? Something doesn't add up. Where's the you are here arrow? This is okay. 
She's a tough cookie. What are they doing to her? Jay, you're gonna drive yourself crazy. Just hope for the best, okay? You hear that? If by that you mean the terrifying sound, then no, I didn't hear anything. You know you did. This place is fucking massive. Son! Think it's safe to grab it? Yeah. Go for it. Y'a quelqu'un? Such a good idea, huh? Yeah, man. 
Not worth it. Ok, qui est là Je vous ai entendu. Qui est là Arrête de crier, j'essaie d'entendre ce qui se passe. Je crie pas. Ta gueule. Je veux savoir où sont les autres. I need to see this now. We've been here before, Alex. Have you been leading us in circles? Come on, guys. We gotta keep moving. Hey, easy with that. We shouldn't be screwing around right now. Nice blade. Could make a nice severance package for my assailants if you catch my drift. I guess you never know. We might have to use it. According to this, today is beef casserole. Hmm, yummy. It's as if everything just ground to a halt on this one day. The whole ship just stopped functioning. Mademoiselle? As if you know your way around a kitchen. Please, relax. Just messing around. Alright, what is this place? I think we gotta go through here. Wait. 
This isn't right. What? What? There's something in here with us. Did, didn't you? I mean, did you hear anything? All right, well, we should keep moving. I know I saw something. It was moving in the shadows. Julia, just try to get a grip. Don't fucking laugh at me! Alright, we've been here before. I'm sure of it. We're going around in circles. Well, what do you want to do? Turn around? We've seen all this before. Cool it, Jay. We don't have a lot of options, Scott. Okay, no. This isn't working for me. What? Gross caskets and crappy chapels. Not my scene, you know? You're right. It's gross and it's crappy. You gotta get out of your toot sweet. And we gotta find Fliss. Okay, so can we just get the fuck out then? What is this? Hey, we got a name on this guy. And what are they even doing here? I don't think stuck on a ghost ship for all eternity sounds like a good plan, eh? Who cares where they're from or where they're going? They're dead and we're not, so let's keep it that way. human? What is the deal with this place? That is some bad mojo, dude. Okay, leave. Now! Leave, leave, leave! Okay, that's enough with the bone buddies. Look at this one. Like for a kid or something. I don't want to know. Let's get out of here. Yes! Maybe that's little baby Dracula. Right there, and those are his parents, and they're lying in the dirt from their native country. And then they all jump on Conrad and eat off his face. <laughs> the end. Got some serious locks in these caskets. Why would they be chained and locked? Well, that's one way to end a relationship. What's the matter? Shh. What is it? Look! What? Seriously? Are you trying to freak me out? Huh? Can we just get out of here? so spick and span. What? Fuck! Hey, this is no time to be fucking around. I'm serious. I can't take it. Oh, what the fuck? Don't touch it! Why did you touch it? Get in some air. Conrad! What the hell? 
Looks like he died of fright. You can't see that. Okay, so this guy had appendicitis, which is pretty routine, and then, and then he died of a massive heart attack, which is not routine at all. Hashtag nope, gone on ahead. Connie! Shh, shh, quiet. I can shout if I want. Connie! Where the hell did he go? that alone. You don't even know what you're doing. You just do whatever he tells you, don't you? Fucking place is cursed. I don't want to hear anything from you. Olsen! Please, you don't have to do this. Jesus! Oh Christ. Oh Christ. That guy. That guy's probably still right here with us. 
I mean, you die on a ship, your ghost stays on the ship. Come on. You have no idea what you're talking about. all your friends go I don't know what the fuck this is all about but we gotta keep moving and find Olsen now Olsen Merde Qu'est-ce que tu fais What's it, Bordell? anyone there? can be a good sign. Oh, Jesus! What happened down here? Oh! <laughs> 
maybe they're through here. Need something to help me get up there. Who's there? Get away!
name is this? Right. What is going on here? Let's keep your head on straight.
Brad. Hey, Brad. What are you... Hey, what's wrong? What the fuck? Okay. Thanks. I could have drowned. I'm sorry, but you did the right thing. It was him or us. Fuck! surprised me with the whole pirate adventure thing and I gotta say it was a good idea. No, it was. I mean, it's funny. I think it's funny, but I think the guys you hired are taking it a little too far, maybe. And don't be cheap. I mean, you didn't feel like paying top dollar and that's what you get. You get these guys that are not cream of the crop. They're taking it a little too far. You know, you get my drift? So if you want to feel free to pull the old plug, get rid of these guys, I'm with you. I mean, these guys are fucking crazy. They're chasing us around the ship. something 
It's, something is fucking. everybody whatever this is it's it's fucking with me okay it's fucking with me If anybody knew what the hell was going on in this place, it would have been the captain. Not much of a practice what you preach kind of guy. I should really take a look behind this door, shouldn't I? Should. But should I? <laughs> yeah, I should. <clears throat> well, all right. So how do I pry this son of a bitch open? I gotta find something to pry the door open. some half to least. Enough for the door.
Get the hell out of me. Come on, we should keep moving. We need to find the others. Oh, fuck. This out of the way! Oh. Oh. Whoa. Come on, we gotta get somewhere safe. Hello. Things appear to have taken a turn towards the spiritual, wouldn't you say? Have you figured out what's going on? How to stop it? How to save the lives of your poor, unfortunate stowaways? You will, I hope. 
although it seems the ship's previous occupants never managed to. Quite a lot of deaths that night. Let me help you out, give you a little hint. No hint. Perhaps you think you can piece things together from the clues you found yourself. Good luck with that. Perhaps you've started to realize something. That everything and everyone may not be quite what they appear to be. I hope that helps. Well, aren't you excited to find out what your poor unfortunates are making of all this and how you might avoid any more unnecessary tragedy? Go on, back to it. Speak soon. What the hell is wrong with you back there? Brad, you lost your shit, like big time, you almost killed me. What? What are you talking? Come on, no, no come on, that's ridiculous. Well, what the fuck is going on with this ship? Because, I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some, like, like, evil, like, literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and- that doesn't sound that crazy right about now. I saw something. This, uh, uh, this old lady. I mean, she was batshit crazy, like dinosaur old. Not that that's a bad thing, but she just, like, up and vanished on me. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. It's probably just your mind's way of telling you that I'm smothering you or something. Of course you don't believe me. You never do. Let's time out, okay? This place is too fucked up to just be fucked up. You know what I'm saying? I mean, like, something is going on here. So what do we know for sure that we can all agree on? <laughs> Am I crazy or are we on a ghost ship? Like, ghost ships are real and this is one and we're totally on it and oh, holy shit, we're so totally fucked? I was gonna say the same thing. Well, I know we're not the first people to see weird shit here. Apparently the guards were super freaked out by something they saw in the cargo holds. What do you think actually happened to this place? A goddamn mystery box is what it is. I saw 1947 on the newspaper. This whole place reeks of weird. Dirty, stinky, weird. And I don't like it. It's like this place is stuck in a perpetual bad feeling machine. What happened to everybody on this ship? Where did they all go? I can't shake the feeling we're in one big floating coffin. So what's with the bodies? They come with the ship? They actually look like they've been scared to death. We know more than we did before. That's something at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. This ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it... That's great, but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. We gotta get off this damn ship. <laughs> no shit. I think we're, uh, speaking clinically, totally effed. I know it sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive.
could use these if they weren't Swiss cheese. Find a way up? Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. Hey, a little help over here. I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. I'll pull you up. This is... This is where I chased Conrad, before. Huh. I, I thought it looked familiar. Over here! Got a way through here. Me. Yo, I got this. Radio yet? No, but there's gotta be a radio on this ship. There, there has to be. I'm not exactly confident about our chances of survival. Take a look. No freaking way! This thing actually still works? Well, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years, as long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Ah! It's working! It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's ask them for help. Hey, hey, is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? Holy oh, shit, we got him. Uh. If you can hear us, we're on a ship, an old freighter. Our coordinates are approximately uh, 12 degrees, 30 minutes south, 
151 degrees, 20 minutes west. Please, get here now. We need help. We're on a freighter, abandoned, huge and old. Hello, hello, is anyone out there? Please come in. Yo, guys, check it out. This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I gotta be honest. I don't think I'm gonna make it down there in my shape. I'll go, obviously. I can do this. I should be the one to go. Hey, little bro. What's up? I'm thinking you might deserve a promotion. How's medium bro sound? <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? You stepped up to the plate. Put yourself right in the line of fire. You're kind of mixing metaphors there. Not if the picture's a machine gun. <laughs> I'm impressed. Seriously. So what do you think? I got... I got this. I'm not losing you to this fucking ship. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Julia, no. You're not my bodyguard. I can take care of myself. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. All right, you and me, Julia. bones everything still work you guys okay down there pipe down let's not draw any attention so what's next we gotta find out where we are copy that we'll wait up here by the radio here After you. Looks like we're in the lower levels of the ship. Someone named Joe was in the sick bay. So it looks like there was some sort of fight and this Charlie went to the brig. 10 day sentence. <laughs> Must have been a big fight. hot baths if we ever get out of here. We're gonna get out of here, Julia. I hope you're right. Am I ever wrong? Might have been the son of someone on board. Jesus.
Come take a look. Look, down there. I think that's the engine room. Good place to find the generator, right? Let's find out. Shit. No more ladder. I can drop the rest of the way. Wait! <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Fine. Come on down. What's up? You didn't fucking see that? Right. No. Of course you didn't. Um, hello? Yeah, I think I'm actually seeing clearly for the first time in a while. Nothing jumped out at me. Yeah, I think we're all going crazy. And I think it's the fog that's causing it. Why would the fog make us go crazy? Maybe we're breathing it in and it's fucking us right the hell up. None of this shit is happening. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. I don't know. It seems like the plane came in contact with the ship, but it's just a theory. Oh, God. All right, let's get going. You ever wonder what would have happened if we went to Japan on vacation instead? Shut up. What do you think? I don't like it. Someone attacked that corpse recently. Too recently. It's pretty weird that whatever damage was done to that thing was done recently. We're just wasting time. Let's go. This? The ship was anchored. I wonder why.
Hey, look at this. The rebreather. I bet the fisherman brought it from the Duke. You think it still works? Uh, it's got maybe a few minutes of air left. Worth taking with us? It's just gonna slow us down. No, we should take it. Parts of the ship are completely underwater. Oh my god, how did he die? Wait, what the hell? That, that's the guy I drowned in the hole before. No use hiding, you little foot. What's the problem with sharing all that gold, eh? There must be plenty of that to go around, more than enough. And we're all in this together, right? Trying to cut me out of the deed? You can't have all the gold. Then I'm to be left here to die. But I am the captain! I am in control! And I am the one that says who goes! And who stays! Ow. He's breathing down our necks. Please tell me you have an escape plan. Again. We're good. 
Here now. Maybe. I knew it. I told you. Did you breathe it in? No. No, I, I mean, we held our breath, man. The, the mist is not inside of us. <laughs> oh, really? I know you're all fancy divers, but you expect me to buy that? We've been down here for hours. You've been holding your breath this whole time! You're holding your breath right now! Oh God. It's in me. I got the mist in me, don't I? It's in me, isn't it? I can feel it swirling around in there! It's changing me! On the inside... No, man. There's, there's no mist inside you. I can tell. Stop! Stop lying! You can all see it in me, can't you? You're all just lying. And the mist is inside. Let's just start drowning ourselves in puddles now. Why not? There's 472 rivets in this room, which can only mean one thing. I've been in here way too long. Hey, is anyone hurt down there? Gotta go after. 
Don't I? We gotta go make sure everyone's okay. Shit! Well, what's our play? You're gonna stay here with the radio. I'll go after them. What if something happens to you? I'm a big boy. This is my mess, and I'll clean it up. I'll be standing by with radio. Good luck down there. How big is this place?